hello friends ignore my day three or four hair i think i did it i don't know what day i did it <laughs> let's just say it's shower day but or, or wash hair day that's ugly light let's turn that off either i'm procrastinating not wanting to go walking tonight when ashley is at cheer which I've been procrastinating very well. <laughs> or I suddenly discovered the clutter here in this game closet. The linen side has been doing pretty good for us. We have things stocked up really well still. Sorry, I just ran up the stairs. <laughs> Clearly I need to go walking at the gym. Um, yeah, so I am seeing stuff in here <laughs> glasses and I'm like you know what this stuff needs to get donated we are on a not a crunch but we are on the last home stretch for Ashley's fundraiser for cheerleading I love that these are all the amazing lids for the amazing buckets I knew that I don't know but I um, got thinking of books. I need to look around my house for books to donate because we get bonuses for books. And I also am going, well, I wasn't gonna tell Jason to do his closet. Let me, let's just go see. I'm not telling him to do his closet. I'm gonna see if he wants to do it on Friday. But he, he told me, maybe I should go through my closet for Ashley. Not for me having to look at this mess, but for Ashley, of course. Okay, he does his hung up clothes very well, right? It, it, they do a good job. You can see, he doesn't have too many. I actually need to gather hangers to do laundry with. He doesn't have excess. He organizes it well. He keeps them on the hangers. Until you look up here, or you look down there, or there, or there. <laughs> so he said, this is not me making him do this. I've told him I no longer will try to fold his shirts a certain way or put them in a certain place because I don't know. I think this is the general area for t-shirts. I, I mean, this is shorts, but I don't, those are pants. So is it shorts or pants? Shorts or pants? Those are pants, but like what kind of pants get hung and what ones don't get hung and then this down here I have absolutely no idea so I've given up he can choose to do that if he wants I'm not gonna play mother to him he can organize it declutter bag up his stuff if he wants all right that battery died I need to get new batteries the knockoff ones are starting to not last very long so anyway the whole point to this and me coming to this closet in the first place was to one look and see if I had um, extra clothes or extra towels. I think we are at a point where we might replace all of these towels. I don't know. I need to give it another month with our budget, get some credit card bills, some travel bills paid off and kind of go from there. But I hope that we can actually donate them with this fundraiser so we can kind of have, you know, a perk to donating them they're fine we've just had them for a really long time and they're no longer like getting white white even with bleach so it's like all right maybe we'll give them some new towels and Kaylee is gonna get some new towels for moving out on her own later on whenever that happens so we might be buying a new batch of towels so that way I can get rid of this isn't even half of it I have two loads of <laughs> towels being washed right now. But I am going through the closet here. This is my game closet. If you have not seen this video where we took apart every single one of our games and put them in these bags, game changer. So I will try to link that, but also you can look up like, I think it was a like game closet organization, I think is what I called it, something like that. But um, <laughs> in the meantime, 
the kids, aka Kaylee and Jacob, keep buying more games. Like, they buy these themselves. I hope that they know that they can take them with them. But I also have found our Skull King. We were wanting this the whole holiday season. Skull King and Cover Your Assets. I'm gonna take those downstairs. We love playing those games. Um, Mastermind you can't put into one of those bags. Maybe I could. But all the little pieces, that one was easier to keep in the box. Anyway, go find this playlist um, and how we did that. But I'm also looking in here. Oh, that's what all the lids are. The lids are all for these buckets, but they don't, I don't want them to have a lid on them. Okay, so I came up to the closet initially because, what did I just want to, oh. I have toys in here. These are like the fake American Girl doll toys. Some of them are real toys. Um, but um, I have all these toys in here that are going to be for like grandkids. I know it's weird. But they're like the toys that I really, really liked. Like these, um, what are these little connect toys or whatever. Um, but also, what do I have? Lincoln Logs. We have Lincoln Logs right here. The kids hardly ever played with this one. They were like right before they like stopped playing with toys. And then we have, what do I have in here? Yeah, yeah, little Duplos. So my friend wanted to borrow these um, just for like a week. I don't know, she doesn't have little kids anymore so I don't know why, but I'm gonna show her that bucket. Oh, we have, what do we have? What are these? Why do we have these? Little golf putters? I have no idea. I think Kaylee and Jacob <laughs> get stuff. But I wanna see if she wants this box. See, these are perfect for grandkids. And I don't have to like buy toys. And they're like, well, I'm gonna take a picture of that so I can see if she even wants it. All right, while I wait on the Legos to put all this stuff back, I just realized the Bananagrams are all out. And you saw this in a video yesterday hanging in my office and I was like, why is this here and where are all the Bananagrams? Well, apparently they're all right here. Didn't know I was gonna do a <laughs> an organization video as I was gathering. This is technically not textiles, I'm just gonna donate those anyway. But <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna put the Legos, not Legos, Bananagrams in here and then try and rearrange this so it kind of fits in here better. Maybe I'll find a lid for that one. Okay, my friend just wanted both of them. She said she's returned what she didn't need, but I kind of don't want them, like, I guess they're maybe different sizes. So, yeah, they're different sizes. But I hopefully she's, I hope she knows she's borrowing them. <laughs> I also need to find out if my friend wants to come get this mattress. Okay, so I'm gonna take those to her when I take Ashley to cheer. I have a pile of books right here. Books, notebooks, a little notebook right there. And then this is dress up stuff and I'm kind of wondering, <laughs> I don't really wanna get that stuff down. I believe that's American Girl doll stuff. So I'm not gonna bother, but I can donate this stuff. Maybe that goes into the bucket that Jason's gonna donate. But I'm kind of thinking Maybe, I don't know if Kaylee has an attachment to the gray blanket here. We have a lot of blankets in here. And I think, I think it's time to donate some of them. Um, yeah. We're gonna make a pile. That's a sheet. I tried to cover this whole thing with the sheet and they didn't like it. So, I don't need the sheet anymore. I wonder if they want him. Not that we need to get rid of it, but I just don't, oh, we use the cooling ones. I like that one. The cooling one. And I think we can get rid of these guys. It's just clutter up here. They like that one. This is the, what do they call this? What is the name? I can't remember. Let's see here. Gudetama. That's what it is. A Gudetama blanket. It's teeny tiny, but they do like that blanket. I don't know why. I don't know why they're bagged up. I guess maybe I should ask Kaylee 
if she has a preference for keeping that one. I don't know. But almost all of these are going to go. They clearly don't get used. They have this new blanket from my sister-in-law and Jason's brother. So, blanket. Yep, these, my sister gave the kids these kinds of blankets. That's a Christmas one. I do like that one, but, you know. Oh, is that Kaylee? She might get mad at me for donating stuff in this room. I want to know what she's done with this blanket. If I can get rid of that one. Oh, is that Ashley? What? Wow, hi. hi. I need... I am... And we have a Christmas tree. <laughs> we haven't taken down. We actually never set it up. Yeah. Um, yeah. The lights didn't work on it when Abby went to set it up. That's and we never got to it because she had her surgery and then we we're like, whatever. But why are all the squishmallows? So okay, oh. can we put them in? Okay, you know what? There's a bin right there. I just emptied that bin. Can you put them in that bin? I'm hot. I don't want to do this for very long. But, what? I have my report card. Just my writing report card that you have to see. Oh, okay. We'll talk about that off camera. Yeah, um, and I was just doodling on myself. Mm. Because I wasn't having hives all day. And I was just like, oh, maybe it's gone. So I, like, I don't want to, like... So I did, um, and now I have hives of where I drew. And, like, it's just, like... Yeah, it's a little bit of a contact hive. So, I, like, room... Like, I like, Go put some soap on a towel. Or I drew a mushroom, and now, like, I could feel a mushroom when I touched it. Yep. And that's the only place it didn't... I don't know. Okay. And Go. then I also have this just, like, one hive. One hive. It's progress. Okay. Yeah. I gotta... I'm on a roll. You gotta go take care of that. Get off of this. I need you to gather up the little squishmallows from right here. Why did... Did Max get to these? Hmm? Why are these all popping open? There's like three of them here that are popping open. Which ones? This one right here is as well. What? Max doesn't get to them, does he? Okay, can you get the little ones and put them in that bin? If it's you want to keep them. Like, that looks exactly like... Alright, I'm not really going to do any more cleaning up in here. Because it's not my mess. <laughs> They're literally adults. They use this room. But I do have a pile of blankets that we're going to donate, put them in this bag, and then I'll take those down to donate. And then I'm going to take those on our way to cheer tonight. Well, I was going to show Ashley and her hives where we're at, but she doesn't have a shirt on. No, put the shirt on. <laughs> and, uh, um, she's going to do her dishes really quick. I am still doing laundry. You can hear the washer going. This is the third load. One in, one to go. So... Okay. Now, everyone wants to know how your hives are doing. I don't know. I think you just... Oh, but it shows up. But it's like one. It's, it's, it's like one or two. That one there. That's the worst it's been. This is really, honestly, the worst it's been in a couple days. And then right there. So, not bad for how it's been. Right? Okay. Go get ready for cheer. Otherwise, she's kind of... Huh? No, you're not. We have to go. Uh, it is definitely shower night. I'm not going to show my hair anymore until after I shower. People said I was a brunette and that I got my, I dyed my hair and that it was showing because I have greasy hair. They were like, that's how my, that's how I feel. My friend just brought over another three bags of, clo of clothes and textiles and stuff. I gathered three bags myself from upstairs. And then she brought two boxes of home goods and books. Again, we get bonuses from books. So, the funny thing is that one of the moms that's, you know, helping us collect stuff, she has a facility. Well, she was going to put it in her shed if she's like, if you run out of room. Sorry, that's so noisy. <laughs> Plays the whole song. Da -da -da -da. She was telling us last night we had a parent meeting. Um, lots of information from... Japan that we're learning about for our trip but um she was telling me that like she, while she was trying to get room in their shed or some other place for the stuff I think from Kaylee Abby's like surgery no they broke that would have been really good actually for ice packs anyway she was trying to clear out some space for us to be able to she's like if you have too much stuff in your garages bring me a load I can store it here until we gather it up into a truck and take it down. 
Um, but in the meantime, she was trying to clear that space out. She's like, she just kind of told her kids, Ch chuck it into the RV that we're not, that like, we're not using the RV right now. So just chuck it in the RV, their motorhome. <laughs> She's like, it turned into be, to be like a really logical place to store everything because you could stack it really high because the walls are so narrow. <laughs> so they've got like half of this motorhome filled up with bags. Boom. And she's like, okay, hurry and get yourself finished over there, please. Um, so she's like, just bring him down, put him in my motorhome, and I'm going to drive the motorhome straight to the donation place. <laughs> We're still going to have to rent um, a U-Haul and or like a... Home Depot truck, because the Home Depot trucks are only like 20, 30 bucks a day. But don't dump the water out in the dishwasher. Just dump the cup into the sink. They do they this, the and then dishes. it splashes all over the floor. It the other dishes. I know. Anyway, we learned a lot of stuff last night at our practice. All the parents met. We all talked for two and a half hours while they practiced, and, um, just learned a lot about the different options and the different things that we're gonna do when we're there. Um, questions so that we still have, some concerns that we still have, but um, it's getting real. And then I gave Jason the job last night because some of the moms were like, well, I would love to do an excursion with everyone, um, you know, after the girls are practicing because we don't have excursions planned for that day for the kids. And I just said, I'm gonna put my husband in charge. I said, I plan everything, <laughs> all of our other trips, including what I was just working on as I was eating lunch. Um, it is my list of restaurants to go to in Hawaii. And it just seemed too overwhelming for me to like try and like figure out places to go in Japan. So I gave that task to Jason last night and he took it to heart. And I just said, if you find things that you think we should go and do, write it down. We can look them up, find the links, text it to everyone so everyone can kind of see what the options are and then we can all kind of, we want to go do this, we want to go do this. There's like a little gondola ride up into the mountains that'd be kind of cool. Um, someone else suggested you dress up as a sumo wrestler and ride go-karts. <laughs> They're just fun things. Kids don't really care. We'll go see a, like a you know Japanese temple. We'll go do some of the things like that, but Anyway, it's not like we can go to a movie, you know, if we have two hours to kill because we won't understand any of it. So anyway, we got to rush off, take her to um, cheer. Haven't decided if I'm going to go back and work out or not. Not really feeling it today. Having a hard time with that. Let me know if you have the winter blues like that as well. So I also want to shower tonight. So, all right, I have been playing lazy. I showered a few hours ago, maybe an hour and a half ago, and climbed into bed, because no one was home. Kaylee's home, Chelsea was home. Abby's at work, Chelsea's at, Ashley is at cheer. So, I climbed into bed. Just watched my phone for a little while. He's come home, showered, worked out. And I'm trying to find my flip flops. What's crazy. with your shoes? They just grip really well. He's noisy and bright. He, he likes he likes bright shoes. Well, he, he takes whatever they give him. <laughs> but we're gonna go get Ashley, but we, I don't know, I don't really wanna stay in bed because then I won't be able to go to sleep. I won't, I know I'll fall asleep at seven o'clock at night. I'm trying to find my flip flops. And I can't fall asleep at seven o'clock. <laughs> so, kind of just getting up and getting out. Um, maybe, Jace, Friday you could, are you there? Oh, he, it's like he purposely knows that I'm going to ask him to clean out his closet. I'll show you how many bags of stuff we have. I literally don't know where my flip flops are. I can't find them. I don't know what. Alright, so we just got Ashley and um, we, have, we took Jason's car. See, it's all nice and dark. Um, no, it's just, just not white. But I forget how low this car is. I just went to get in and it's like I boom dropped. I mean I just don't I just I didn't anticipate how low the seats are. I, it's been a long time since I've been in your car. Super um long day. But anyway. Um I wanted to ask you, you had mentioned a little while ago that you might clean out your closet. Your idea, not mine. 
Yeah, I said there's a few things down there I could put out. A few? A few, because you've been... You've I been, have not been taken. Do not blame over me. Over the years, you've slowly, like, just taken... You can't, out. you can't do this. You can't do that. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You if have. I were to touch your side of the closet, it would not look the way it does now. <laughs> yes or no? So what are you asking me if I... You brought it up. Yeah. You mentioned it. I said, yeah, there's probably some things I can donate. Okay, challenge yourself to one bag, one trash bag, in your daughter's honor for her her donations. Challenge yourself. Okay. I bet there's a lot of clothes in there that you could um, donate and clean up your closet. Are you trying to guilt me into this or something? Yes. It was your idea, so now I love it that it's flipped <laughs> no, and it's not I'm my totally fault. No, I'm totally fine doing it. You're just being super manipulative from the beginning. Just like, hey, uh, you said you, want, you had things to donate. Uh, we can do those. I know. And I'll be like, yeah, this yeah, This is I a funner way that. to do it. Oh, manipulation? <laughs> anyway. Well, we were, anyway. We, it's a 20 year marriage. You just feel like you gotta manipulate first. It's just a natural, natural instinct. <laughs> Great. No. Well, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. All right, we'll see if he does. If you can sift through it tonight. But tonight? No, not tonight. tonight. We're tight. Oh. No, we got a little squiggle. <sighs> yeah, because it shouldn't go that fast on an on ramp. Yeah, I got a little back end. So we'll just kick out there. Technically, we're not over the speed limit, but that was a bit ridiculous. And I love that Ashley doesn't even like budge a peep. Like she's just in her own little world back there with her phone and her friends. No, my phone. My phone is your phone. Come on. Okay, we're gonna say goodnight to you guys. Um, stay tuned. See if he cleans out his closet on Friday. <laughs> no, because all day today I've been kind of cleaning things out. You have a lot of bags. Did you count the bags? No, I, have, I need to like, I need to count them. You said you were gonna count the bags. I said I needed your help counting the bags. <laughs> He's, he's reversing. He's reversing. He's doing it back to me. I can't manage all of it by myself. I need your help. Thank you very much.